Tonight, we're learning a lot more about Hansen's violent criminal past and a previous bank robbery that should have put him in prison for the rest of his life. Eight on your side's Jeff Patterson joins us now live from the Hillsborough County Jail with that part of this story. Good evening, Stacey. Tonight, James Hansen is in a Hillsborough County Jail facing those charges of bank robbery, carjacking, and murder. But today, I reviewed a very large court file that shows at one time, Hansen was convicted of another bank robbery and sentenced to life in prison. Tuesday, James Hansen was brought into the Hillsborough County Jail accused of bank robbery and a violent murder. But in 2002, Hansen was arrested and convicted of another bank robbery. Court documents reveal Hansen walked into an AmSouth bank on Armenia Avenue, put a gun into a teller's face, and demanded cash. He was then sentenced to life in prison, but that sentence was ultimately overturned. It is very unusual, and I would imagine that it must have been a compelling reason for the state to come off of the life. Tampa attorney and legal expert Bryant Camarino isn't involved in Hansen's case, but he did review part of his court file for us, including this handwritten motion written by Hansen himself asking for release from prison. Yeah, it's been my experience that inmates, they have, unfortunately, all the time in the world so they can rehearse, they can, they can uh, their penmanship gets better and better and better. Hansen was eventually released from his life sentence because he successfully argued the original prosecutors withheld evidence from his attorney in the 2002 bank robbery that may have shown he only used a BB gun to hold up the bank. Camarino says Hansen had plenty of time to work on that argument. And he probably had access to unlimited resources, law books, and who knows, other inmates who've been experienced enough. They could have been lawyers, they could have been police officers, uh, ex-police officers. So it looks like he had the resources there that helped him draft the, uh, the motion. Late this afternoon, we did receive a statement from the Hillsborough County State Attorney's Office on James Hansen, and there's even more to this, because the state attorney says in 2016, Hansen agreed to be a witness in a murder case against another inmate. That led to a conviction against that inmate and Hansen's eventual release from prison. The Hillsborough County State Attorney says the hard reality of our criminal justice system is that sometimes prosecutors have to use inmates to testify against other inmates. Reporting live in Hillsborough County, Jeff Patterson, 8 on your side. And we are learning more about this case every day, so you can head to our WFLA app right now to read why the suspect told detectives he robbed the bank in the first place, which ultimately led to Mr. Corotiel's death.